All you have to do on mobile is go into the Kiwi browser and load the extension. You just do that here from zip file. You load whatever extension it is. I think it's already loaded. Oh, it loads it twice. That's not good. So let's remove one of these. They're identical. Oh, I see they get unique IDs. So I removed one, have it enabled. Then you go to Street Easy right here, refresh the page, and it should, well, you should go to page one. Yeah, let's go to page one that way. So in order to go to page one, you can just get rid of this part here and it should start paging through. If you refresh the page, yeah, see, it's automatically doing this and it's automatically putting things in the database if it, you know, if it's working properly. Let's see. It should do all the pages that it can. You might want to move around. It can seems to only show about 10 pages. I'm sure there'll be some issues after this. And when it's done, it should update the database. So let's look at the database while we're here. We can just open up. And I think you have to keep it going. We can just open up the uh, Title Foresight, which is here. Let's just go. Let's see how this thing remembers. Okay, there it is. Prop Title Force. And that's just delinquent property, but you can go to Rentals. Rentals. Uh, page not found. I think it's just without this. And then you can just put in owner. So you can just get rid of that and then see. Yes, yeah, see already things are coming in. So date descending and all this stuff 300 and and uh, 34 are found and uh, obviously the stuff that came in the last few minutes data sending somewhere from 12 hours ago these were some initial tests where the 1000 is not uh, accurate it was just a a price and the bedrooms we're going to add in too because right now it's not but there it is minutes ago peace out